Well, f what have I done? Well, hey guys, welcome back. Got another great Beer to Pop Does It, so you don't have to. Man, what have I done this time? Scouring eBay for some of the best, some of the sketchiest mystery boxes around. I don't know. We've had some good luck. We've got some good collection stuff. We've got some good stuff that you guys have picked up from me on Macari or just by commenting or hitting me up on IG, you know, that doesn't fit my collection. So before we get started with some crazy mystery boxes from eBay today, guys, I just have to tell you thank you for all the support, especially during this time. It's great to talk to you guys, comment back and forth, hit me up on IG. It's been a lot of fun. I really appreciate it. If you're one of those that isn't subscribed yet, click that down below. Give me a thumbs up. Maybe even click that notification bell. But either way, leave me a comment. How's everybody doing? Getting through? Everybody safe? I hope so. Before we get started, I definitely want to do a shout out for all the food service workers, grocery store workers, medical, as well as everybody on the firefighter and the police force for helping keeping it down during this time and keeping us safe and fighting the good fight for all of us guys. Thank you. So everybody, let's get started. We've got some great boxes from eBay. Figured before we get started, though, check the P.O. box. I got my monthly Patreon gift from Dom over at Box Attack. Um, like I need to, but I'll link him below like I do. Um, if you don't know who Dom is, go check him out. But I'm sure everybody knows who Box Attack is. So right here is uh, his box from uh, his monthly Patreon. I've been a Patreon of his for a while. Uh, me and uh, Jeremy, Captain Pops, had him on our live a couple weeks ago with Jetta. Uh, make sure to check out um, the uh, Saturday Lives with me and Captain Pops. We rotate every Saturday, so check your listings to make sure to find out who's hosting. And let's see what we got from Dom over at Box Attack. Boom. What do we get, guys? Ooh! We got a Batman Entertainment Earth exclusive, one of the 8-bit ones. That's a really cool one. I don't have that one yet. And uh, that'll be a great one to add to the collection. And it's purple, like B.O.P. <laughs> Thanks, Dom. Always pays off helping support your channel, man. And I do appreciate the uh, awesome Batman pops. It's a cool one. All right, so what have I done, guys? I mean, you just got to remember, Beard of Pop does this so you don't have to, but maybe you do want to. I know a lot of you have. So, guys, I ask every eBay seller after I receive the box, before I do a video, if they want me to put a link up or anything, and I will tell you, like I say always, most of them don't. And that makes me a little wary when I'm doing the video. But, you know, hey, not everybody sells Funko Pops all the time. Some of them just do it as a one-off thing to get rid of their collection. Who knows? But we've got a couple. And then we've got one from All Things M. Henry. I'll link them down below on eBay. So far, so good with some of their boxes. I've got a few more coming. I've got another one, another $80 one to open today. So we'll get to that one too. So we'll go in order of price, right? And there's two that are very close together. This one right here was $39.99. $39.99. It I think it had like $9.81 shipping. So we can pretty much say 50 bucks. But you know how it is. I don't count shipping. And then these, you know, they had the normal, like, here's a wall of the best pops, right? And then here's the other wall. So no matter what, these are the pops you're going to get. And this one was more like, you'll get one off this wall, one off this wall, one off this wall, and extra stuff. Like they had pictures of, uh, I believe this one had like keychains and pins and stuff like that that they might throw in. So not really sure exactly what we're going to get. 
but I did it. You don't have to. So we'll see. All right. There looks like there is one, two, three, four, five pops and a bag of stuff. All right. So how about we get started with this bag of stuff right here? Oh, and the first thing we got is the glow in the dark Batman Gamer uh, Pocket Pop. It's pretty cool. I got one of those over in my case over there. And um, I think I do have another one too, but that is a pretty cool one. And uh, we'll make sure to show you the glow up in the corner. And we also got the matching glow in the dark Batman Gamer Pez. Well, hey, that's a pretty good start. Some pretty cool stuff. I know if time gets tough, I'm digging into that Pez. <laughs> all right so that was all looked like the extra stuff so now we got the pops well, let's see what we got now remember this was 39.95 so we'll say 40 bucks boom <laughs> that is the chalice exclusives uh vegeta gallic gun that is another dragon ball z i don't have check that out every video i shoot I almost pull a Dragon Ball Z out of a mystery box. Well, that's still a pretty cool one, and yet another Vegeta. Man, there's a lot of Vegetas, and Gokus, and All Mights from uh, My Hero. All right. The next one is, boom. Oh, it's Kling from H&R Puff and Stuff. That's the uh, Toy Toy uh, Tokyo Limited. I uh, believe they released that around the NYCC. Uh, they also had, um, this is the Kling, and then they had Clang, and then, as it says, you know, they had Witchy Poo, and that came in a three-pack. I do have that. But uh, that is a really, really awesome pop. All right. So the next one is, let's see. So far, I think that's pretty good value. It's not just like Toy Story pops or like, um people pops so we're off to a good start the next one is azuka from evangeline that is a really cool pop guys definitely sticks with the anime the next one we got is boom Baruto. Oh, it's the uh, Naruto second generation. That's uh, Sarda, number 672. That's an awesome, awesome pop. And the next one we got, guys, is Super Saiyan Goku. Yet another anime pop and another Goku pop. That's an Entertainment Earth exclusive. We'll definitely show you the glow in the dark up above. That's an amazing pop, guys. All right. So the next one after that anime-filled fun, this one was $43.99, so 44 bucks. It had free shipping. No guarantees, just the generic picture of a mystery box. Ugh. So I don't know. We're going to find out what we get in here. Maybe some more anime pops all right so first one we got is oh that is uh spider-man far from home that's the glow in the dark walmart exclusive uh mysterio that's a cool one um we'll definitely show you the glow on him along with the others uh up on the screen that's a pretty good pull don't know if he holds much value, but he's in a pop protector, which is a good start. The next one is, boom. Oh, that's the uh, Funko Shop exclusive Bigfoot. That's the uh, Rainbow Bigfoot. That's a pretty cool one. That wasn't bad. They both came in some pop protectors. This one's a little bit on the cheaper side, but it's still a protector. They were packed well, so that's pretty good. Got some pretty good pops out of that one. Nice. Hmm. All right. So all things M. Henry on eBay. We got that $100 box that had a bunch of stuff on it. And um, 
it had a lot of cool stuff. A lot of you guys thought it was cool, but some of you guys said you wouldn't enjoy it because of all that extra stuff and you wouldn't know what to do with it. Yeah, I understand that, but it was fun. There was a lot of cool stuff in it. So, I ordered up another one. This one was 80 though, and um, it's heavy. Not exactly sure what's going to be in it or what we're getting here, but it's heavy and it's big. So, let's check it out. So now today, we've about sampled over $200 worth of mystery boxes from just eBay. Oh, this one's loaded up again. Wow. All right. So, how are we going to do this? The first thing is, this is the Dorbs. Ooh, that is a cool pull. Look at that. That is um, the, from Wonder Woman movie. That is the San Diego Comic Con 2017 limited edition Dorb. That is a neat one. Wow. Actually has the Comic Con sticker on it too. That is pretty cool. Wonder Woman and Aries. Cool little Dorb so far. And then the next one, which was something that people complained about. The last time was all the bags. Looks like we got some of the same bags. We got the uh, Freddy Funko. This is the Stranger Things bag from uh, Fun Days. We've got, uh, oh, we had one of these, the uh, Nightmare Before Christmas bag. As well as uh, more of the um, placemats. The uh, Justice League. The Hogwarts. And the Avengers. So we got our stock in bags, but you guys have been loving it because I've been giving them away. Go check out my Patreon down below because I've been sending stuff extra like this to my Patreons as well when you're at the $20, $20 and above level. I've been throwing some of these fun things in for you guys. Um, let's see what else we got in here. Oh. We've got another uh, another one of these, uh, the C-3PO hats. That's pretty cool. It's an official pop hat made by Funko. We also have, oh, we have a uh, Boba plush mini. That's a cute one and a different one than the one that I had gotten in the last box. So I like that one. That's a cool one. Yeah, and we got a few of the same here, guys. We got the um, the Death Star uh, luggage tag. The Stitch luggage tag. We've got a Pop Olaf's Frozen Adventure cookie cutter. That's an interesting one. I've never seen that. That's an actual Funko product. It's a cookie cutter of the Pop. Huh. Never have ever seen one of those before. We've got a Rogue One patch. And what else we got? We got a sealed Incredibles tin um, from the Disney Treasure Box. And it's sealed in a tin, so let's open it up and see what it is. I think the last one I had from this was a year ago, was that Lilo. Um from Lilo and Stitch. Oh, it's a blind one. What did we get? Oh, check it out, guys. Well, that's pretty cool. Little mystery mini in a tent tin that was exclusive to the when they did that Disney Treasures box. So open that up. We'll just grab. We got a bunch of stuff in here. Oh, so we've got some more patches. Got a Star Wars patch. Go through a few of these. Let's check them out. Oh, this time we got a Piglet patch instead of a uh, Robin Hood Fox patch. And we also got a Scrooge McDuck patch. I'm going to have to find something cool to do with some of these patches. We also got a little, you know, the Robin Hood pin. We've got a, another one of those Disney Captain pins. 
Got one of these. I'm not exactly sure who this guy is, guys. So if you let me know down in the comments below. We've got another Star Wars lanyard here. Do have another uh, a Peter Pan patch. And if you any of you guys collect patches, man, let me know down below. Hit me up on IG. And what's this one? Oh, we got a uh, Olaf from Frozen pin. Let's see what else kind of stuff. We've got more of this stuff. So we've got one of these Ghostbusters. They blow up from uh, the fun days. You know, you make noise and beat them together. We've got a Gremlins one. We've got another Goonies one. Um, I didn't send a, uh, I didn't send a Goonies one. I didn't keep the Goonies one. I sent it out to somebody for a video, um, as a present. We've just got some of these Funko Fun Days ones. And then we have three different colors of these Funko Fun Day ones, um, other than the green that we already got. So we got all four colors. All right, what else we got in here? Oh, we've got a, a Star Wars Rogue One t-shirt. This is definitely a cool shirt. I don't know if I have this one yet or not. But that's the official uh, pop tee. Alrighty. What else are we getting to in here? We've got uh we've got another bag from Funko headquarters. And what do we have inside? Ooh, we have a uh, a little money thing. Oh, this will go with my Freddy Flux I already have. That's from, I visited Planet Fun Days and I actually have a Freddy Flux I can display with that. This is the actual ticket from Fun Days. We've got a Freddy sticker and actually take this guy. We might be able to get him over onto the desk unless he's too old and then he's stuck to the backing. I know some of these ones. No, he's, he's good. We're going to add him to the desk over here. All righty. Freddy Funko. Holding the big boy. Doesn't stick very well, but uh, I'm going to make do. <laughs> Pretty nifty. We got the bag and an FD08 sticker. We also got a little uh, little Freddy Globe sticker there from the uh, fun days. And we got a different pin this time from uh, May 5th, 2018. Oh, and then they included a flocked bullseye. This is definitely a cool pop. We also have the uh, Conan O'Brien uh, number 18 Super Conan GameStop exclusive. Oh, and to go with the other mug I got last time, we got a C-3PO ceramic mug. Uh, the last time I got a Jabba the Hutt mug. So this one's pretty cool. Check him out. The job is kind of weird shaped. So is this one, but I might actually use this one. It's a pretty cool mug. Might I say awesome mug. <laughs> so guys, make sure to comment down below. Let me know what you think of these boxes that have more stuff than pops in it. Do you like crazy mystery boxes like this? Or do you just like strictly pops? Does it depend? We've got some other. I found another pin. Oh, check it out. It's Donald Duck and uh, Daisy Duck there. That's a cool one. We also got Conan O'Brien number 19, which is Revealed Conan. Oh, 
And then we do have some more of these, which are like the uh, table to go with the Avengers, the table to go with the Justice League. This is the mission brief. Where it pretty much is attention table ca captain. Congratulations, fun, funny, fun act. You have been selected, fanatic, sorry. You have been selected to lead your table during this intergalactic journey. You are here by the table captain. By accepting this mission, you agree to abide by the Funko Federation oath while performing the following duties. You must wear your foam signaling device during any time that prizes are being distributed. If your team or table is awarded a prize, you must signal to your nearest prize patrol agent using your signaling device to acquire your team's prize pick. Each prize pack will include 10 of the same prizes. Each one of the table members gets one. And that it's your responsibility to distribute them and you're going to lead by example. And that the uh, fanatic universe is counting on you. And you know the table cards. And this was a uh, Team Spirit sign contest. Kind of got that on there. And then just the Team Spirit contest that everybody was to take poster board and markers left at their tables and make signs. And we've got another one. we got a little box here. Oh, and here we've got some more of these little Deadpool cards that you get with the t-shirts. Deadpool for hire. And then we also got a Darth Vader. And then some more of these Whitmore Forest cards. So, yeah. Some of the same stuff. It was a mystery box. I didn't know that these would have pretty much the same stuff as the other ones in them. And then the last thing we got out of this box is Conan O'Brien number 20. Just the straight Conan. Yeah, so, you know, this was a good box again. I think I got a good value of stuff. I got a lot of similar things. Some stuff that's the same, but then some different things. So, um, all in all, that's pretty cool. Um, I enjoy it, and I enjoy the boxes. Um, I think they're sending another one over, so we're going to have a little bit more fun with one of these down the road. Uh, we got some pretty good boxes off eBay and got some cool stuff today, definitely for the collectors. But uh, this has been fun, guys. So, guys, if you're not subscribed, click down below. Give me a thumbs up. Stick around and check out my Patreons. Very thankful for them. They're helping my channel out in this hard time. And, guys, stay safe. Until next time, Beard to Pop, out.